Some members of Vietnam's Legislative National Assembly have expressed concerns about a proposal to slap a heavy tax on officials with unexplained incomes or assets, saying it could be used to launder money. Under an amendment to the anti-corruption law drafted by the government inspectorate, If authorities confirm that a civil servant's assets or incomes were greater than the values they declared, or they failed to provide valid explanations where they came from, they would face a 45% personal income tax bill. National Assembly Delegate Trong Trong Kyu said, We should not impose a personal income tax on civil servants who fail to provide valid explanations for their assets because the tax would only be levied on their legal incomes. The proposal made by the inspectorate could pave the way for money laundering, he said. Explaining that the tax payments could help civil servants launder money earned from illegal activities such as a trade of drugs and smuggled goods, corruption and stealing public assets. Violators would be willing to pay the 45% tax and keep the rest. Nkia said, if civil servants fail to explain the illegal sources of their wealth, authorities should seize the assets, he added. Agreeing with Nkia, Delegate Lupin Huang said the proposal was groundless and infeasible. Tax rates should be regulated under the tax law. He stressed, head of the Institute of Legislative Study in Guyan and Kuyan Satmas declared that it should be resolved by a court and true legitimacy. Vietnam should study the UN Convention on Corruption Prevention, which includes regulations on illegal immigrating to deal with the matter. In addition to the much debated measures, the bill would involve the government inspector at being directly responsible for monitoring the assets and incomes of officials in leading and managerial positions. In the draft, The government inspector also suggested making it mandatory for civil servants to make all major payments via bank transfers to control their incomes. The National Assembly is scheduled to hold a final discussion on the bill before voting at a session in May. Vietnam Sweeping Corruption Crackdown spearheaded by General Secretary of the Communist Party in Guyan Phu Trung has ensnared scores of high-profile officials. The party has pledged to step up its fight against corruption even further this year to filter out corrupt officials and tackle violations committed at local levels. The Corruption Perceptions Index CPI, released by Transparency International in February, ranks Vietnam 107th out of 180 economies based on perceptions of experts and business people. Vietnam scored 35 on a scale based on for deep-rooted, systemic corruption and 100 for a very clean environment. Last year, it was ranked 113th out of 176 countries and territories with a score of 33, an improvement from 31 in 2012. The video is sponsored by cntronic.com.